This is for Leo versus Pisces. This is for Leo versus Pisces. So we're rising to be the signs. I appreciate every single one of y'all. My name is D-Rita, the Media Dollar Terrible. Once again, for those of y'all that are new, and welcome to the Media Dollar Channel. Let's see what's coming in for Leo versus Pisces right now. So we got engagement. Some of y'all could already be engaged. But those of y'all that are manifesting engagement, your love life is extending to a higher level of commitment. So things could definitely be changing, but we got to pay attention to the red flag. So before getting engaged, the universe is going to send you some signs and it's up to you to determine if this is for you or not. And then we also got wedding. So for those of y'all that are already engaged, this is a wedding in the future. For those of y'all that are married, this could be renewing your vows or possibly a honeymoon. Thank you, Ashawn. I appreciate you, baby. Ashawn was that for Libra to skip the line? What else is coming in? I appreciate y'all. Thank y'all so much for tuning in. My name is Dee Reader. Okay, okay, okay. And welcome to the Me and All channel. I appreciate y'all. Thank y'all so much. Let's see what else is coming in right now. We got codependency. So we got addictions are affecting your love life right now. So thank you, Anna, for Sagittarius. So um, Libra did skip the line, y'all. So Libra will be after Leo. And hey, Amber, how you doing, baby? And Sagittarius will be after Gemini versus Pisces. Once again, if I have not said your sign or your relationship, that's because the donation was not sent in. All right, y'all. Let's see what else is coming in for this relationship. Thank you to Mia for Leo versus Taurus. So Leo versus Taurus did skip the line, y'all. So Leo versus Taurus will be after Libra. I appreciate y'all. Thank y'all so much for tuning in, everybody. This message that we are currently doing is for Leo versus Pisces. I need everybody to flood the comments of that zodiac sign, even if you are not a Leo and even if you are not a Pisces. All right, y'all. So we got healing family issues. So for a lot of my Leos and a lot of my Pisces, if somebody didn't have the best relationship with their mother, somebody didn't have the best relationship with their father, and this is affecting the dynamic of the relationship, your love life benefits as you forgive your parents. That's the thing for this connection right now. What else is coming in right now at this moment? We got honeymoon. So for those of y'all that are already married, we just talked about this. This is a honeymoon or this is a vacation. Maybe this is just going on a vacation for Valentine's Day. That could be what's coming up for this relationship right now as well. But we do have unrequited love. So for some of you that are separated, it looks like there wasn't enough attraction or chemistry to keep the relationship going in a healthy way. For some of you, the dynamic could have been a little bit too toxic, which could have been separated, y'all. And it also looks like somebody was, like, religious or on a spiritual journey in this connection. I appreciate you, baby, for being here. My name is D-Reader to me, Dr. Terry. Once again, for those of y'all that are new, what is the final message for this relationship? So, we got forgiving and learning. So, for a lot of my Leo. and for a lot of my Pisces right now at this moment, as you release and heal from the past, you will experience more love currently in the relationship. Yes, you can, Anna, if that's what you want to do. That's fine. I appreciate you. Y'all got to let go of this. I appreciate you. Now, I didn't get that from you yet. The CA notification must haven't came yet, baby. I appreciate y'all. Thank y'all so much for being here. What is the final message? So, we got release your ex. So it looks like somebody's holding on to their ex in this connection. I don't know if this is you, Pisces. I don't know if this is Julio. But that can also be, you know, affecting this connection as well. Thank you. Thank y'all. I appreciate y'all. I haven't got no CA notifications yet, y'all. So they must be coming late because I see people in the comments. They're starting to come through now. Yeah, somebody um is holding on to their ex. Thank you for the tip, Gretchen. I appreciate you, baby. Yes, I did just get that from you. Yeah, the CA notification is coming late, y'all. Y'all know I'm going to announce it. I always do, y'all. I just haven't got it yet. But um, it does look like somebody's holding on to their ex in this connection. I don't know if it's you, Pisces. I don't know if it's you, Leo. But that's also, you know, affecting their dynamic. So until you let go of your ex, and that goes on both ends, I don't know if this is going to come back together. At the bottom of the deck, he passed a year ago. Okay, okay. We got past life relationships, so that makes perfect sense. Yes, y'all were lovers, even in your past life. I appreciate every single Pisces and every single Leo. Thank you. 